Hey guys, I'm Danilo and welcome back to another video. So last week the guys from Pedal Train reached out to me and guess what? They challenged me to create three different pedal boards that sounded great for three different gig situations. At first I was like, well, that doesn't seem very difficult to me. But I later found out that there was a catch. In fact, I am only allowed to use their Nano Plus pedal board, which is uh, this one. Also, there is a price for completing the challenge. If I manage to complete this challenge, Pedal Train agreed to give away not one, not two, or three, but 10 Nano Plus pedal board to 10 of you guys. And it's worldwide. So it doesn't matter where you live, you can win one of these. Well, if I complete the challenge, I'll do my best for you guys. Okay, let's dive into the challenge. Here's the pedal board. It is really lightweight. Pedal Train was the pioneer in rail system for pedal boards which is funny to think about that these are now commonly called rails. It's because the brand that invented it is called Pedal Train. Got it? Train, rails. As I was saying, it is lightweight, it has aircraft grade aluminum materials and it's very comfortable and easy to carry around. They also gave me this carrying bag, which is really cool. But the problem, of course, is that there is limited space for pedals. Okay, so let's see what pedals I can use to complete this challenge. And this is my currently pedal collection, and I'm gonna use those to try to win this challenge. So, I thought about which three different gig situation pedal boards I wanna build, and they are. The Rock Jam pedal board. You know, the easy one to carry around for jam nights with friends. Do you remember the good old times when you can actually go out with friends and have jams, right? Yeah, me neither. The Metal Band on the Road pedal board. Imagine being on the road with five people all in the same minivan with uh, guitars, amplifiers, drums. The last thing you want is to have an additional massive pedal board with you. And number three is the marriage party pedal board. And this one is, uh, well, based on my personal experience because I do play a lot of marriage parties. Well, used to, thanks to Covid. And we need a very versatile pedal board that could be useful from rock to ballads to pop to jazz. Nah, I'm just kidding, no one cares about jazz, especially at parties. Sorry, jazz. Okay, now let's dive in and start with the Rock Jam pedal board. Okay, what do we need for our Rock Jam pedal board? First of all, we're gonna need the power supply. So, here. Okay, maybe a tuner? I don't know, it's a jam night after all, who cares? The other thing I really want to use is this one. This is the Z-Drive pedal, which is made by my friends at guitarstutorials.it and it is really great for a classic rock sound, so we need this. We are already running out of space, so I think I'm gonna use this one. This is really great delay and reverb all in one pedal from my friends at Flam, and it's called the Ecoverb, and it is also very cheap, so I really recommend it. Okay, I think for a jam night this could be it, so... Usually pedals like modulations, reverb and delay should be plugged into the send return of the amp, but let's just keep it simple here and put all the pedals in the front, because why not? I'm gonna use all three pedal board plugged into my Blackstar HT5, which is running through my Torpedo Captor X, so we can really push the valves of the amp. Okay, now let's hear how this Rock Jam pedal board sounds. Ok, now let's move on to the Metal Band on the Road pedal board. I think for this one I wanna take advantage of the dirt channel of the Blackstar for our main distorted sound, so it's one less pedal to put on our pedal board. Let's see. We can start of course with our faithful tuner. Then I really wanna use my Maxon EQ just to push everything and to scoop the mids just a tiny bit. You know, in name of the metal. Uh, I wanna use the Ana Sounds delay because it has a tiny little switch that adds modulation without having an additional pedal on the board. 
so here. And since we have a tiny little space left, I'm gonna use my Hall of Fame Reverb Mini, which fits perfectly. Let's do it. Ok, we are almost there, only one pedalboard left, and it is the marriage party pedalboard, so let's go! Ok, this is a tough one, because I really want to use all the pedal at my disposal, but we can't. Let's see. I think we cannot use anymore our faithful polytune, because, uh, well, I need space for other pedals. So, instead of using our faithful polytune, I think we're gonna use this one, the old classic and cheap headstock tuner. Then we need a compressor, because it really helps with the clean sounds, and it goes here. I think we're gonna use again the gain from the Blackstar, but way less gain this time. Then we're gonna use again the Maxim EQ, but this time as a solo boost. So every time you need to make a solo, just press it. For the next one I wanna use one of my favorite pedals ever, this one. This is the MXR Unlock Chorus, which is a killer pedal and I love it. So this one goes right here. As you can see, there's not much room left, so we're gonna use again the eco verb, delay and reverb all in one pedal, and it goes right here. With this type of pedalboard, I really suggest you to use an amplifier with a foot switch, so it's easier to switch from the clean and dirt sound of the amp. Okay, let's do it. That's it! I think we did a pretty good job. You know what? Yes, we did. We actually won the challenge. So, let's do the giveaway, shall we? Ok, here are the rules. In this video I just played 9 songs. The first one to comment with all the correct song titles already win one of the 10 Pedal Train Nano Plus. Go! Go, 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 go! Ok, there was already a comment, right? Don't worry, there are still 9 of Nano Plus to win, so here's what you have to do. Make sure to follow Pedal Train official Instagram page, my Instagram page, and leave a comment on my latest Instagram post, which is this one about the Pedal Train giveaway. I will make a live streaming in exactly one week, so we can talk, you can ask questions, and I'm gonna randomly pick 9 of you guys to win one of these bad boys. Don't forget, this is a worldwide giveaway, so you can join wherever you live. 
Okay, that was it for today's video. I hope you enjoyed it. Good luck to everyone and congrats to whoever already guessed the 9 songs of the video. I'll catch you in the next one. Ciao!